A solar cell is essentially a PN junction with a large surface area. The n-type material is thin to allow light to pass through to the PN junction. Light travels in packets of energy called photons. The generation of electric current happens inside the depletion zone of the PN junction. The depletion zone, as explained previously with the diode, is the area around the PN junction where the electrons from the n-type silicon have diffused into the holes of the p-type material. When a photon of light is absorbed by one of these atoms in the n-type silicon, it will dislodge an electron, creating a free electron and a hole. The free electron and hole have sufficient energy to jump out of the depletion zone. If a wire is connected from the cathode n-type silicon to the anode p-type silicon, electrons will flow through the wire. The electron is attracted to the positive charge of the p-type material and travels through the external load creating a flow of electric current. The hole created by the dislodged electron is attracted to the negative charge of n-type material and migrates to the back electrical contact. As the electron enters the p-type silicon from the back electrical contact, it combines with the hole, restoring the electrical neutrality.